motivation and discipline and how it can affect your fitness. So consider that oftentimes motivation and discipline are often misused terms. So, but just basically, I feel that motivation is that fire, that motivation. You know, sometimes I love to be motivated and I love to motivate people. That's part of what I do. By the way, that's I am a fitness coach. If you're interested in connecting me about your goals, I can coach you virtually. Just reach out to me on my number inside of the description of the video. But I love motivating people and I love getting motivated. I love waking up in the morning and listening to an inspirational video, you know, getting psyched up about my day. That's motivation. But you know, we're not always motivated. That feeling isn't always there. I, I'm 56 as of yesterday and I started working out when I was 13. So that's like 42 years ago. And and I've never not worked out. I've never been through a phase in my life that I that I was inconsistent. You know, there were times where I didn't feel like working out. Most of the time, though, I do enjoy it. I love the workout process. But there were some days when I was tired and just didn't feel like putting it in. But of course, afterwards felt good afterwards because you know how that can feel afterwards. But the fact that I did it anyway, that's the discipline following through when it comes to fitness on your discipline of exercise, getting in your strength training, getting in your cardiovascular training, and being disciplined with that. You know, it doesn't matter. You can start small and work your way up, but just having some kind of sort of a program and being disciplined with that. And then with your nutrition, there are many nutritional strategies to consider and by the way, I coach on nutrition. So if you're interested in getting coached on nutrition and help with that, please reach out to me for that initial consultation. But being disciplined with the day-to-day -day meals and being consistent with it. You know, if what have you decided to use intermittent fasting? If so, are you being disciplined with it? How are you being thoughtful with your meal timing? Meal timing is, I feel like, something that's often not really thought about a lot but most people they want to lose 20 pounds or more i feel like intermittent fasting is something to consider it's a great natural way and there are a lot of health benefits to it besides so it's it can be a very healthy thing to do for your health and it can help eliminate unwanted body fat so but just being being consistent with it the motivation to start something see that's where motivation comes in you're getting started right but the discipline is the day-to-day -day action that you're doing. If you're going to only eat from, say, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., and that's the only time you're eating, that's an eight-hour window, and you're disciplined with that, that's, that's, that's discipline. That's what's going to get you those long-term results. So that's what I really want to make clear on this video, at this point, is that there is motivation, and then there are discipline. Is discipline, excuse me, and... I want you to understand the difference between motivation and discipline. It's great to be motivated. Get motivated. Get out there and do those workouts. Do those meals. But some days you might not be motivated. So it's more important that you are disciplined. That you're taking action on your exercise every week. On your nutrition every week. You're being consistent. Getting your rest every night. Seven and a half to nine hours sleep a night, by the way. And that's, that's what's recommended by some of the top neuro <clears throat> neuro doctors in the world. So those are some things I want to leave you with. Motivation versus discipline. Motivation is that fire that gets you going. Discipline is that day-to-day, week-to-week, month-to-month, being consistent with training, nutrition, recovery, supplementation, and mindset. The discipline is what's going to get you there on the long term. And by the way, that is what I teach in my coaching program. If you're interested in a complimentary consultation so we can talk about your goals, please reach out to me on the phone number inside the description of the video or fill out the form at fit.fitness, just like it sounds, F-I-T dot F-I-T-N-E-S-S. -S. And bye for now.